Paola Rebellón was 25 years old when she became pregnant with her son Jacobo. It was an unplanned pregnancy with a man she didn't want to marry. But knowing she would be a single mother didn't alarm her. For me, it was simple. I've always had difficulties with relationships. People here are so dependent when they are in relationships, so much aggression. And when they are pregnant, they are needy. But I was so relaxed when I was pregnant. Paola Rebellón's decision to be an unwed mother is the norm in Colombia. In fact, 84 percent of all children in Colombia are born outside of wedlock, according to a study conducted by the World Family Map. The international report says Latin America has the highest percentage of children born to unmarried mothers. One of the more alarming conclusions of the study showed Colombia has the highest number of children living without either of their parents, 11 percent, making them more vulnerable to abuse. Psychologist Victoria Cabrera says not having at least one parent can be detrimental to development. A higher level of parental supervision is ideal so that youth can have lower levels of anxiety, hostility and aggression and higher levels of academic life and they're more likely to postpone their sexual activity. As a professional from a middle-class family, Paola admits she has more help than most single mothers in Colombia. She not only works part-time as a psychologist, but she also has help from her mother. My mother has always emphasized that I should spend more time with my son. She says, take advantage of the fact that I can help you. Stay at home with him. Quality time with children is key, says Victoria Cabrera. A study by the University of Savannah showed a two-parent household doesn't necessarily assure greater results in development. The children we interviewed in our studies said that they count on their mother, friends, and the Internet in that order more so than their fathers. Having fathers be in that fourth spot is a call on dads to be more involved in the education and formation of their children. The traditional family structure is changing, and while mothers are choosing to raise their children out of wedlock, studies show the most important question is whether or not they can dedicate the time necessary for the development of their child. Michelle Bigot, CCTV, Bogota.